one of our favorite guests. Loved hanging with him and all of his friends in Kansas City for the Big Slick, raising uh, millions of dollars for the local children's hospital there. And Rob Riggle's Ski Master Academy is streaming free only on Sony Crackle. All eight episodes available right now. Good to see you, Rob Good to Riggle. see you. We just saw a nice clip with you and Brian Urlacher. Yes, the very. How did now? How did you cast Brian Urlacher here as, as the guy who runs the rival canoe camp across from your <laughs> Ski Master Academy, Rob? Walk me through the process. Yeah, here. well, uh, Brian and I actually became friends on a USO tour uh, back in 2014. Okay, and it was an interesting tour, by the way. It was me, uh, Brian Urlacher, and yes. Meghan Markle, who has gone on to great. Royalty fame. Yes, indeed. I don't know if you knew that or not. She actually married a royal. <laughs> she did. Probably didn't hear. Not it. Kansas it didn't City get, It didn't get much play. She, she didn't wear marry Mustaka. Not a Kansas. No, okay. not a okay. Mustaka. Should be so lucky. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. So anyway, we bonded there and uh, uh, had a had a great time. But anyway, I needed a nemesis, and I couldn't think of a better nemesis than Brian Erlacher because he's this big, mm -hmm. sweet kind of teddy bear type guy, and I needed someone that. I could unjustifiably be rude to and mm -hmm. mean, and with his size and proportion, just have him be sweet and nice, yes. and me constantly ragging him. It, I just always love that little yapping dog at the big dog yeah, yeah. kind of comedy. So I threw him in there. Well, you're no, you're no wee man yourself, sir. I mean, <clears throat> but Erlacher, when you meet him, yes, he just he, he, he just keeps going. Yes, he's much bigger than you would think. When he you, is a big man. He's a big huge and man. quick, which is you know you're not supposed to be big and fast, right? God only does that to a couple of us. Right. Us. Yes, sir. Nobody? Okay. That's us. Just us. <laughs> you and me, Rich. Yeah, yeah. And Erlacher. And Erlacher yeah. are the only ones who really get it. So when you met Erlacher, he he was bald, right? He didn't have the hair, right? No, he did when not have first, hair. He right. did not. Uh, is he different to you now that he's got hair, Rob? I mean, how has he changed? I'll be Erlacher? honest. He does walk a little taller. He seems a little more confident. Um, yeah. I know it's bothering you, though. It yeah, seems yeah, like there's... Brockman and I, Brockman and I have had a problem. He, 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 it's like, in, look, you're, you know, you understand. You don't leave a good man behind. Never. Okay? And Brockman and I, we feel we're good men of the mm -hmm. bald brotherhood. Yep. And he left us behind. That's what it is. It's Rob? the brotherhood. It's the BB. It's the bald brotherhood. The it is that. Yeah. He... <laughs> That's where this is. Okay, okay. It's all about us, Rob. I yeah, get it. No, but I get it. It's all about us. You feel like um, somehow he he Benedict Arnold you a little in bit. a way. Now, he, now I have a question for you. Is like is like folks like Travis Kelsey upset you didn't you know stay within the family, the the Chiefs family to to cast anybody in the Ski Master? I haven't received any pushback Oofra? yet yep. from from, <laughs> Ka, from Trav on that one, um, but I'll, I, I, I'm open to I just, hearing. I don't want to stir anything up. Well, now. season one, I like to float it out, I, you know. And and look, Travis Kelsey, I I think if he keeps going, he'll be a Hall of Famer too. But this year, I was only casting Hall of Famers. <laughs> You've got a very high high bar, high standard. <laughs> it's, so it's for season two of Rob Riggle's Ski Master Academy, which yes. can be uh, for season one streamed right now uh, on Sony Crackle. How about Andy Reid? Don't you think he? No, I mean he, he he doesn't look like a guy that you think has comic chops. No, I would but not I think, assume at all. I know, but don't you think you know him on a him on a jet ski? I would, think is gold. Look, forget personally. about that. Yes, I mean that would be comedy gold. That alone. I don't even have to give him dialogue. Don't you think? Just watch him out in the middle of a lake wrestling a jet ski. <laughs> might be might be worth it. Okay, I'm writing this down. This is not bad. <laughs> Mentally, you're taking yeah, the I'm, mental I'm actually going right to put now. this like, the, this is a possible script. Or yes. he could even open his own uh, camp uh, also across the lake. A rival. Uh, a rival camp. Uh, uh, what is it? The um, Those paddle boards. Just seeing him on Andy a paddleboard. Reed's <laughs> paddleboard Academy. To, yeah, just, yeah. you know, seeing if he can get across the lake. That would, again, right. comedy gold. Right. And they keep the dialogue down to a minimum, so it's really good. I think, it, by the way, is that a new fantasy team name? What Andy, is that? Andy Reed's Paddleboard? Andy Reed's Paddleboard. <laughs> you, you're in a fantasy league, Rob Riggle, tonight, are you I not? Am. You're drafting I, this evening, are you not? I have a big draft going down with my league, the Hollywood Phonies. Um, just who's, a collection who's in the Hollywood of, phonies. Who's a collection that? of real jerks. Um, I, I want to protect their anonymity. Okay. But uh, Matt Walsh. Okay. Um, Big Bears fan. Yeah. From Cordry, Pete. Rob Cordry. He's here Friday. Okay. Um, we got Jerry O'Connell, Ron Livingston, Adam Pally, Scott Armstrong. Where's the uh, Where's the draft? Paul Shear. Where's the draft being held? Um, where does it get held? Your house? It, it's, it's done electronically. Constant. We don't. We're not doing a. Oh. Uh, we're not taking over a tavern. 
Which we should. Dude. We should. So you're just all sitting in your office? Yeah. Wherever the doing hell you're doing? Doing smack talk via the keyboard. You but you need together? eye contact when you do smack Come talk, on, right? Yeah. You want it to sting. What is... Yeah, I mean, you don't... Yeah, it's message league. boards are so 90s, I think we try. We, I think we do try. We've tried in the years past to, mm -hmm. to converge, and then, you know, attendance hadn't been that great, so... Okay. We, we, I think that's why we've been doing electronic. What's your draft position? Where are you drafting today? Real simple. All Chiefs. No. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that's your strategy. But what's your what draft choice do you have? What's oh, your... I don't even know yet. Um, uh, you don't know. I don't know. Oh, so you're ready. You're 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 ready to. You're just gonna show up. I'm gonna just show up. Roll and nail the virtual this thing. footballs out. Yes. And what's the name? What's your team name? Do you even have that? Uh, duck butter. <laughs> Why is it called duck butter? Well, do we need to know? Or is it? I, I can't explain it, but I think a lot of the guys out there know what I'm talking about. <laughs> did I just step into that one, Brockman? Do I have? Did I just? Uh, step? I mean, you can just go to Urban Dictionary and just check it. You know, it used good. to be like it's when totally I was fine. again because I, I oh, the gosh. Chiefs, the the Chiefs, yes. my team. Yes. Uh, back in the day, it used to be somewhere over Dwayne Bow. Oh, I like that somewhere over Dwayne Bow. That's good stuff. When you're a chief, Rob. man, that's how it goes sometimes. <laughs> you gotta, now you got to just say you're over Tyreek Hill. Now we're entering like Berman zone right now over the uh, uh, Tyreek uh. Hill. Uh, <laughs> at Rob Riggle on Twitter, and then you're getting set for NFL uh, on Fox for this Sunday. You, yes. You, yeah, you we, 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 it's, it, it begins. And so it, it begins. Does. Year seven of wow, you've been uh, doing this seven Fox years Fox NFL pregame. Damn, man. Yeah, I know. This will be my seventh season. Uh, having a blast. I love it. Um, uh, I, I can't get enough. So, okay. And they, they, they're not getting rid of me yet. Not yet, Rob. I can tell they want to. They're, no, every no, day no, I walk no, in there, no, they no. give me that, they no, give me that no. stink eye. Bradshaw wants a, a, a special pass to the Ski Master <laughs> Academy. Now, See, oh, be, I would love so, to bring those guys out. Come on now. Come on, Stray. But uh, it, it's, Howie, it all seems of them. like, but you remember Terry, Terry in the 80s and 90s. I mean, Terry. In the 70s when he was a country 70s? music singer? Oh, yeah. That's and Hooper? Who can forget his appearance in Hooper? The Ski Master Academy's got that 70s, 80s feel to it. It does. Rob. It does. You know what I mean? Oh, I, I would love to bring him in on a stallion. On a <laughs> on a white stallion. Um and maybe one that hasn't quite been broken. So he's having a hard time <laughs> controlling it throughout the scene. I mean, that would be okay. I kinda wanna see that now. Do actually. you have the budget for it? No, not at all. Um, <laughs> but that's okay. I've got a lot of friends. I can call a lot of favorites. There you go. Which that's is what right. I had to do for this one. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, Rob Riggle, uh, you are, um, I think, the biggest Kansas fan I know. Okay. Thank you. You uh, Well, you're welcome. Uh, and also, I'm sorry, because hmm? uh, this past weekend. I'm sorry, I'm not familiar. No, yeah, you're not familiar with the sport no, of I didn't. college football. I just assumed we won. What was the score of the Kansas Jayhawks uh, football competition? Kansas Jayhawks football competition, a 26 to 23 loss to Nichols. I'm sorry? Nichols. Nichols. Is yes. that a person? Nichols, yes. Uh, we have found out. You, you, you don't know who Nichols is, I've right? I've never heard of Nichols. Okay. Would you like to know who Nichols is? I'm not sure I do. Okay, you ready? Here we go. This is the this is who is it Nichols State with all with with Nichols State Nichols College Nichols State Nichols State I know all the states in the union, sir. There is no <laughs> state called Nichols. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, Francis Redding Tilu Nichols oh. was an American attorney, politician, judge, and a brigadier general in the Confederate States Army during the American Civil War. Good Lord! A two-term governor of the state of Louisiana. From 1876 to 1880, and then from 1888 to 1892, sort of the Grover Cleveland of the State House of Louisiana. Holy smokes. Okay. It's in Thibodeau. So this is a Louisiana institution of higher learning. Would you like, care this to know is, more about Nichols? I'm, no. Hold on a minute. Hold on a second. Uh, Nichols uh, joined the Confederate Army, um, participated in the first battle of Bull Run, uh, and in the Shenandoah Valley campaign in Virginia where he lost his left arm. <laughs> Well, hold on. Uh, the during the Battle of Chancellorsville in 1863, a shell ripped off his left foot. This guy had a rough go of it, huh? <laughs> <laughs> it's, so, is it too soon? Is it still even too soon? Okay, so let's Rob, break it. Let's break it down. Yeah. Uh, the Jayhawks uh, football program is on the on the rise. I know it's hard to believe after a, a stumble at home on the home opener against Nichols. Who, by the way, um, had no, had a battle at Richmond, lost an eye as well. Had no eye, no arm, and no left foot. Correct. Uh, but still managed <laughs> to put together a, apparently a quality football team. 
<laughs> because they beat us in overtime on the home opener. Um, yeah, no, I heard. I, I, I heard all about it. And uh, uh, if you want to hear me say it out loud, yeah, yeah, it cuts like a knife. And uh, I'm not happy about it. Mm-hmm. Uh, but... Does it make it any better? I'll knowing? never say a bad word about my Jayhawks. All I'm assuming there were some terrible calls. That's my. Oh, oh, I'm assuming. Definitely I'm assuming blame the officiating. Was, there were there were in Michigan's loss to Notre Dame. See, too. you get it. Terrible calls. Terrible calls. Absolutely. I have no doubt. Dreadful. And um, I'm sure that we're going to bounce back next week with vigor and verve. Who do they play next week? Do they uh, play, by the way, Central at Central Michigan. There you go. You got to travel. The, the chip, chip monks, the right? Chip, or chip, Chippewas. <laughs> what are they? Chippewas. Not the chip, yeah, chip <laughs> Not the chip monks. No. The chip. Uh, the Chippewas. The Chippewas. You right? got it right the second the time. The Chippewas. Right? Okay. Um, Who do you hear from when Kansas loses? Like everybody. That? Everybody that I know. Um, really? All my friends. Um, I have a Michigan friend who loves to remind me every loss oh, wow. that we Kansas endures. M- much like uh, Nichols, we don't have a, much of a leg to stand on. <laughs> If you will. I don't right. know. Is that too, again, is it too soon? Stoney, I will say Stone Street has been pretty gracious. Kansas and, State got a scare, didn't Kansas State get yes, a scare? Yes, they did. They got barely one. You know? Their home opener. That's right. Um, or at least their season opener. Yeah, I don't know if they played South Dakota. Yeah. The two of you. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But so, he, um, yeah. yeah, but everybody I know pretty much calls to give me the business on that. Okay. It's, by the way, enjoy it. Laugh it up, fuzzball. Cause it's it's gonna when we turn it around, I'm coming for you. Who's the fuzzball? All everybody. Everybody who's yeah. been texting you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so uh, Rob Riggle's Ski Master Academy. Uh, how did you come up with this one, Rob? Honestly, it was it started as a joke. Um, <laughs> and it, it ended it, as one. It, it really did. Uh, people would ask me, "What are you doing? What are you doing these days?" And I would get tired of giving people my resume, so I told them I was opening a jet ski academy, mm-hmm. and then I'd walk out of the room and. On the drive home, I'd be like, you know what? What if I did open a jet ski academy? That'd be pretty fun. And then I started thinking about who the cadets would be, who would be on the staff, who would be my instructors, Mm -hmm. what the lake would look like, who the lake commissioner would be. And so I just started filling out this world. And then I pitched it to some comedy buddies of mine, uh, Bennett Weber and Chris Peasy and um, Sarah Tiana and some other folks. And Uh we started started pitching this stuff around. And we put together a pitch, and Sony Crackle, in their wisdom— Infinite wisdom. Infinite wisdom yes. said, this makes sense to us. <laughs> Let's go have some fun. And we did. Mm-hmm. And we made a ridiculous comedy that is everything I hoped it would be. Honestly, uh, a lot of the times when you make a TV show, it goes through this filter and gets watered down, and, and you know too many executives weigh in on it, and it doesn't turn out to be what you started it to be. Yes, we got no interference. Like Sony Crackle was on board from the get go, and they let us run amok. Well, and- I, I think that you 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 could easily state that a good management team, when they hear the idea of a ski master academy, should just let you run with it. You know I, what I mean? Like there's I, no, <laughs> there are no notes. Thank you. That they could possibly yeah. like just let you go with it. Yes. Huh? Yes. The, the, and the I mean, couple, what would they say? Like and the couple you know, of notes they gave us were yeah. like, could you maybe use. Uh, like a bottle of liquor instead of the bag of cocaine. And I would say, mm, the cocaine plays. And they'd go, you're right, it does. And that's that. Wow. And that's how we worked it out. It's, I mean, these guys it, are it's, fantastic. It's magic. Again, it's they magic. let us, they really let us do. I haven't been involved in many projects where um, you feel like your voice actually got out there. Yeah. And I feel like it got out it, there. It got out there. It got right? out there. Cheech Marin. I mean, Christopher oh. McDonald. I mean, that's Shooter just, McGavin. Shooter you Mc- may know him better as Shooter, Shooter McGavin. Shooter friggin' McGavin. Um, we had David Arquette. We had Jamie Lynn Sigler. Um, uh, Tim Meadows, you know, plays oh, the Lake Commissioner. Fantastic. Who's one of my favorite all time. The Lake Commissioner. Yeah, which is, is not there a any, real thing. Is, was that based on Roger Goodell, the Lake Commissioner? <laughs> I'll let no. you watch and decide for yourself. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Just want to make sure yeah. that we're all good. Um, I love ha- having you here, man. Before I let you go, yeah. bigslickkc.org You're awesome. is the website people go to yeah. and donate to Children's Mercy Hospital in Kansas yeah. City for for which you raised how much money this year? Uh, $2.2 million in one weekend. And you and your whole team here, Mm -hmm. uh, much credit goes to you because you came out. No, you came out and you set up shop and you did your whole show from the K. Yep, um, that was fun. And you've been a wonderful supporter uh, of of this charity and this event. 
and we're very grateful to you and everybody here. So ten, thank you. Ten years next year. Right? Coming up on ten years. It's hard to believe, but mm -hmm. yeah, ten years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and we've done we've done I think some good for for some very deserving people. And it's again bigslickkc.org uh, for an incredible cause. Uh, and then there's the Ski Master Academy. Don't miss the Ski Master Academy. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Also, I'm going to be in night school at the end of this month. Uh, a Kevin, Kevin Hart, Tiffany Haddish movie. Um, Dude. It's going to be a good one. That's fun. Fantastic. Yeah, but, uh, but definitely enjoy. Look, guys, you cannot beat the price on Sony Crackle. It's 100% off. It's mm. free. It's free. All you got to do is just watch. That's They're it. all waiting for you. All eight episodes of glory <laughs> waiting for you. And Erlacher. And early. With a T-shirt tucked into shorts and a belt you know, and high ankle, high knee socks. I'm telling you, you're going to see him like you've never seen him before. Fantastic. Good to see you, Rob Riggle. So Riggel. good to see you, man. Come back anytime. At Rob Riggle on Twitter. Again, check out Rob Riggle's Ski Master Academy. Uh, free right now on Sony Crackle. The Rich Eisen Show. Weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.